guys, Kirsten here. Um, as you can see, I got glasses. I got them uh, about a week ago. So yeah, that's great. I got a new phone for Christmas. Oh, Samsung Galaxy Core. It's it's a good phone. It's okay. It's basically the same as my other one, just a little bit bigger, um, and a lot more modern too. Uh, website release. I will be releasing a website hopefully next month. It'll be called um, Us Time, obviously for my channel, me and Mackenzie's channel. Uh, I will be hanging out with Mackenzie tomorrow after school, so I'll be hoping I can work on it with her and get started on it. Um, okay. Why are cartoons so addicting? Like, do you ever find yourself, you watch, okay, you say to yourself, Okay, listen, I'm only going to watch one episode, and you find yourself five hours later watching another episode. Like, I've been addicted to Wild Kratts lately, and like, it's like, holy crap, this show is stuck in my mind. Um, I'm watching it like every day, like, <sighs> like, it's just so addicting. It's, oh god, it's crazy. And, um, a friend of mine had asked me today, and this is what got me onto this topic, is have you ever had a crush on a cartoon characters? And she asked me who they were, and I'm like, yeah. So I figured I'd share that with you all today. And I've had crushes on quite a few. Like, my first cartoon crush was Fred Jones from Scooby-Doo. He was my first ever cartoon crush. I fully admit that. And then my second cartoon crush, oh god, was Shaggy Rogers, again from Scooby-Doo. And then my cartoon crush right now is Martin Kratt from Wild Kratts. He's, oh god, he's just so cute. <laughs> so, um, I'm going to do a and a and um, I will say... Have I ever had a relationship with somebody else? No, I've never actually dated somebody. True fact, I'm 13, never dated a man. Um, ever got drunk? No, never. I've never even tasted booze before. I mean, my mom cooks with beer in some of her food, and it tastes good and all, but I wouldn't just, like, drink it, like... <laughs> like, no. No, you don't do that. Have you ever cried yourself to sleep? Most definitely. Bullying at my school is terrible. Cough, cough, principal, if you're watching this. Probably not, because that would be really creepy. It's terrible. You can't even go walk down, like, the hallway without getting, like, a dirty leg. Like, like, ew. It's her. Ew. She's wearing that. Ew this. Ew that. Ew. She's that. Ew. Shut up. Like, nobody cares about your opinion. Your opinion doesn't matter. Okay, the next question was broken a bone. I have. I broke and sprained my ankle. I broke it on a trampoline because I was dumb and I landed the wrong way. And like, okay, so this, let's say my hand is like your normal foot, right? I landed on the side of my foot with all my body weight on my one foot and I snapped the growth plate. That hurt. But then again, the sprain hurt worse. I, um, I tripped over my own foot and fell down a flight of stairs at school. It hurt. Don't recommend it. Be safe. <laughs> walking downstairs don't di get distracted like I did and trip over your own foot not a smart idea another question I have been asked is have you ever fallen asleep during class quite a lot like today we had like this harmony movement program and he was talking for like half an hour straight oh my god I fell asleep and I felt so bad like Mackenzie was nudging me like yo Kirsten yo yo you gotta wake up I'm like, shit, sorry man. It was really boring. And I often fall asleep in French class. I don't like French, like I respect French people. But it's kind of boring because our teacher's like all like, class dojo! And it's like this website where he can like track us and like we have like, well not like stalk us, track us, but like track our behaviors and stuff. And it's so boring, like oh my god I hate it so much. Um, so yeah. Okay, this one's for you music lovers, like me. Um, my favorite band is One Direction, right there. And I got, like, my whole wall going on here with One Direction. Um, my favorite artist is Alan Jackson, and my favorite type of music is country music, because 
I grew up in country. My dad listens country. My mom listens to some country, more like Adam Lambert and stuff like that. So yeah, that's that. Um, comment down below who's your favorite band. Because why not? I mean, five seconds of summer, they're okay too, but you know, no. Those of you who like the rainbow, that's not me. Good for you, you like colorful things. I like blue and green, and then I like blood red. I love blood red. It just, it appeals to me. I like dark blue, like navy blue, midnight blue, and baby blue. My favorite shade of green is lime green and dark green. Um, my favorite school subject, uh, uh, probably art. I mean, history is pretty cool too, like, I don't know, probably art. I don't like gym, nor do I like math. I never really understood math. Um, a scary time. Okay, those of you who live in Canada, you know that Niagara Falls is amazing, and I've been there quite a few times, and I've survived Nightmares Fear Factory, and it's really great in there. Like, <laughs> um, it was really scary the first time I went through, because my dad always makes the youngest person go first. And I always happen to be the youngest, because it's always just me and him, and he won't hold my hand. Like, no, when you go through a haunted house with somebody, you hold their hand. Unless they're like some gangster, like, yo, I can do this, but not me. And, um, yeah, I almost pissed myself. This guy, okay, so my dad said my name. He's like, go, Kirsten, go, you can, you can do this, right? So the guys that are working in the in the um, Nightmares Fear Factory started calling my name like Kirsten, Kirsten. It was so creepy. Like, oh my god, they like they tap me on your shoulder and they'll like touch you and uh, and there's like spider webs hanging from the ceiling and like dead corpse hanging from the ceiling. It's really cool. I I totally recommend Nightmares Fear Factory. I've also been through. Uh, House of Frankenstein. Great too. I went through it once. I still prefer Nightmares Fear Factory. Definitely better. <laughs> and, um, we got our picture printed off, and my face was like, <laughs> like, it was so messed up. Like, I just, I can't even. So, yeah, that's my QA for now. I'm thinking up more questions. Like, I just have everything written down on a piece of paper at this point. So I'm going to think of more, and I'll do another one. So, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.